Hi everyone, this is Martika and uh, here I am showing you a paperback album that I just did recently. I uh, managed to buy um, the Basic Grey Origins collection that uh, when I saw it I just fell in love with it. The colors are just uh, awesome. Um, the yellows, the browns, the greens, the blacks, I mean there it's just beautiful. So I decided to do a paperback album and here I am to share it with you and I hope that you all um, can uh, be inspired by it. Um, as you can see I used uh, I used some of the the chipboard, the paper, the acrylic um, the acrylic stamp from Origins and some of the glazed brads and the felt uh, flowers with the buttons in the middle. They are totally, totally awesome. I loved working with this paper. I love the, the, the matching um, em embellishments and I, I really enjoyed it. Um, here I use some Rick Rack and I use some of my personal collection of ribbons that I usually buy from Joann's Fabric and Michaels and even the the sheer ribbon I try to get at the Dollar Tree um, and I just collect when I see these ribbons I just buy and and hope that one day I will need them and here I am using some of them um, here is the first and second page of the album um, this is uh, here I used I used the space. Um, I left it open so that a uh, nice picture can be put on it. Here is some chipboard from the Origins collection and here is the three-dimensional picture, um, I'm sorry, flowers that are done with I guess it's stickles. I guess they use stickles on it but these are the three-dimensional flowers. This is the die-cut pack that they sell plus this and I went ahead and did a, a you can really say it's a non-functional tag but I just loved it I liked it a lot even though you can turn it around and put maybe some journaling or a nice little picture in it um, there's also another tag that I did and put another die cut um, to write something it says remember when uh, and this one says the details so that you can just add your little notes you know something to remember I also on the first pocket I added this tag this huge tag that fits in that side pocket and there's three to the album um, you can put a picture on the outside here and there's also it's like a pocket where you can put something inside so there's plenty of room to put um, some nice pictures I also um, added some buttons some of my um, collection of buttons that I have and some ribbon um, let me see uh, the next page I did was also you I always like to make room for some pictures because um, one likes to use them as an album so I always manage to leave space for pictures so here I added this matting with some of the uh, uh, scallop border um, and you know to put a picture in there and uh, here this opens up this is the flap this is the short flap of the bag so I wanted to make it functional and somehow so what I did was I added this piece of paper where it folds over and I made room for um, to put journaling maybe a picture here if you like um, and then you just close it up and tie it up with a night with the nice bow which I'm really not going to do right now but um, and there is a slide tag that comes out from under the flap of the, the bang um, that you can also put some journaling or maybe a, a wallet size picture or something like that. Uh, I used these flowers that I got from the dollar store I think. I think they were from the dollar store and uh, I used the glazed uh, brads from the Origins collection. Um, these are the three-dimensional 
flowers also and some of the chipboard from the Origins collection. Um, and here is a, a butterfly that a nice friend of mine uh, named, named Debbie gave me and I was able to add that to the album which I thought looked really cute. Um, this is another tag, another large tag where you can go ahead and add something inside of it and maybe put a picture on the outside if you want to put a picture otherwise you can leave it showing the pretty paper which was really hard for me because um, this paper is so pretty that I would hate to hide it. So here is the next two pages and this page I did the same. I used some of the glazed brads and uh, some of the lace, some of the lace that I that I have and some of the uh, dollar store flowers. This is a tag that you can remove. Um, I used some stickles for a little bird, a little stamp bird that I had with a little cage. I experimented basically. And here uh, you can put maybe a picture in there. Um, this is um, a sunflower lace that I bought at Joanne's Fabric. And uh, this is one of the acrylic stamps from the Origins collection, which was really nice. Um, that worked perfectly. It says, Memories of You. Um, this is uh, the next two pages and oops this opened up um, this is a die cut from the collection um, it says do something today to make the world more beautiful um, I thought this worked good with all these flowers and, and all these colors and what I did was I just um, glued it to a little um, accordion album that I did for it that you can put little wallet size pictures if you like or little comments or quotes or what have you also this also is to put pictures this is um, a tag that I went ahead and added this is some ribbon and a little butterfly clip that I bought from um, Etsy from someone that sells these little things that I thought they were really cute um, this is a stamp right here. Actually no it's not a stamp. This is uh, a rub-on from the um, Origins collection and I used some rickrack and some ribbon and again I went ahead and added another of the felt um, the felt flowers with the button in the middle. I thought it was kinda cute. Um, it's a nice little pocket you know to put stuff in. This is another tag. This album does have three tags, three large tags with the button that matches um, and again you can put something behind here um, let me see here is two, the last two pages which are interesting I think they were fun to do this is another pocket with another large tag this is uh, string pearls that I use for my collection and some ribbon and this is a butterfly charm that I added just to make it you know pop and uh, again some of the flowers and from origins this page is a little bit interesting and um, this flower I bought from Michaels they have them all colors now with the spring season they're beautiful this is a black um, a black large mm. flower which I found that it was really really cute um, this ribbon I got from Joann's and this is one of the clips from the Origins collection. It's a glazed clip where I managed to put it in the middle with the idea that anybody can just add a picture or something to it like that. Um, it is a three a threefold or a trifold uh, page that you open up. I cut out the border of this and this is from the Origins collection also and I went ahead and did some extra pages this is uh, some of the die cuts and the chipboard from the collection and and some of the paper and flowers and it is a, a trifold so to take advantage of the space um, well this is my album and oh I forgot here is a little birdie 
that I put a little brad here, which is one of the brads from the Origins collection also, of the glazed um, brads. And um, this is the end. I hope you enjoyed this album. I had so much fun making it, and I hope that um, this album was fun for you to look at. And I hope it inspires you, and, um, and hope to see you soon. If you can leave some comments um, and let me know if you in, if it was a good video because it is my first. I do want to improve. Okay, so thank you for looking. Bye.